Mr. Talha, there are two yes, types sir. of the functions that are based on return type of the functions. And the very first type of the function that I am going to tell you over here in detail. All right. And the function type is value returning functions. What are the value returning functions are there? I do tell you about the value returning functions. A function that returns a value when it is called. My dear, I did tell you in the last lecture. All right. We do write some functions to perform a specific job. For example, if you want to test a number, whether a number that is given over there, the number is a prime or not prime. All right, my dear? Yes, sir. You do write a function to test a number. All right. And then after okay. writing the function, my dear, you do what you do call the function and when you will call the function the function will be executed are you getting my dear yes sir yes sir and right now i'm telling you about a function that is a value returning function my dear a function that returns a data value when it is called for example my dear you have written a function and you have written a function to test a number whether a given number is a prime or not prime my dear and when you will call that function it should return a data value and the data value will be prime or not prime any one of these two the data value must be what prime or not, not, prime. not prime are you getting my dear yes sir to make you learn over here about the value returning function, my dear. Say, for example, you have written a function over here to compute the square of a given number. Say, you are specifying the input over here for what its returning value must be there. Sir, 16. Okay, thank you very much. Your answer is correct, my dear. Thank you, sir. Mr. Talha, for example, you have written a function over here and the function name is scare root. All right? Yes, sir. And when you will call this function named scare root and you will pass an argument 81, what this function will return a value to you? Sir, it will return nine. Congratulations. Your answer is correct, my dear. Thank you, sir. Last example to make you learn over here, my dear. Last example in this context to make you understand, my dear. See, you have written a function over here and the name of the function is is prime. And the purpose of writing this function is to test a number, whether a given input number is a prime or not prime all right and this function will return any one of the data values prime or not prime any one of these two 
And the question to you, Mr. Talha, the question to you is, if you call this function name is prime and you provide an input number as an argument to the function named is prime and the argument is seven now the question to you is what must be the returning value that will be returned by the function named is prime tell me sir it will return prime congratulations your answer is correct my dear thank you sir my dear value returning functions are used when only one data value as a result is returned and that result is used directly in an expression my dear some of the value returning functions in the c++ library are sqrt function log function and power function 